Austru, Austru, dragă trăguță, Mi-ai cerut ciora cu panglicuță, Și-ai mai vrea, și-ai mai vrea, și-ai mai vrea matale, Să-ți cumpere neica și sandale. And deceased from all contacts with either Israel or Jewish uh, uh, citizens, involvement, citizens, etc., etc. It's total uh, no-no. He says it's going to be very difficult because it was part of the preparation for right. this. So what happened at grant. the end of the day? The end of the day is that on Friday night we had a, some siblings uh, of very minor category coming to the banquet. Mm -hmm. I mean siblings of the of the big right, right, right. of the big shots. But not the actual uh, officials. Not the actual officials and all that. I gave a, a, a nice uh, speech, nice talk during the Shabbat dinner at the New Otani Hotel, but everybody knew that something is not right. right. We didn't tell anybody what's going on because we didn't want to scare them and all that. Right. The week that was supposed to be a week of celebrations became two and a half days, wow. literally, of torture. And we departed on Sunday afternoon to to Bucharest mm -hmm. because uh, the only airline, that's, that's the only it. airline that was uh, uh, available that day, and we went to Bucharest for a few hours, and then continued to Israel. Right, right, right. But this was a failure of the first uh, first category because of a step that Israel took, and thank God Israel did it to destroy the Iraqi nuclear facilities, but we could not accomplish our purpose of recognizing Bulgaria for what they had done. There was no monument, there was a monument but it was taken away, right. there was no symposiums, there was nothing. But fast forward for us a few years later, uh, yes. when, uh, the, uh, when you were in Israel yeah. you wanted to plant a tree for yes. Bulgaria yeah. and you had yeah. tremendous opposition yeah. from the Jewish groups from Trash. Russia and uh, Macedonia. Correct. <coughs> 14 years later, in 1994, or 13 years later, yep. 1994, we invited King, the, the son of King, King Boris III, right. yeah, King, King II. Simeon, who, uh, now communism is dead, right. and Simeon is back in Bulgaria, and he's going to run political party, and he was elected as pr right. prime minister in the 19 in the late six, uh, 90s, uh, early tw uh, 2000s, right. and we invited him to come to a banquet sponsored by the Jewish National Fund at the Beverly Hills Hilton Hotel in, in Beverly Hills, in California. in California, Los Angeles, California, and we were going to have a gala, gala banquet honoring Bulgaria. Right. We had worked very hard for weeks and weeks, meetings and meetings of propaganda, of planning, of programming, of and indeed it was very expensive dinner uh, for uh, to honor Bulgaria. We gathered a uh, quarter of a million dollars, and that money was sent by the Jewish National Fund to Israel to plant the Bulgaria forest. Mm -hmm. They gave us a location, which was not the best location, but it's fine. It was half, a, half away between Tel Aviv and Jerusalem, right. but uh, sort of like south of the highway. Right. And they gave us nice... A little parcel. Uh, parcel where there were some trees already, and we were going to put three monuments. Mm -hmm. One for the king and his family, um, because... The, the wife of King Boris, uh, uh, Giovanna, Queen Giovanna, who was the daughter of Victor Emmanuel III of Italy, mm. the wife of King Boris was instrumental in helping many Jews, especially 5,000 Jewish children that traveled through Bulgaria to Palestine. From Bulgaria to Palestine? No. From where? Ju children from all over Europe. Uh -huh. she, gave, she gave them safe haven in Bulgaria to be able to go to Palestine. Exactly. So Queen Giovanna really should be 
recognized. Recognizes righteous Gentile. A righteous Gentile. Because she was. And who is the third and, monument and for? So one is for the king mm -hmm. uh, and the family. One is for the church. Right. And all the names of the of the bishops and the pat patriarch. At that From what you're telling me, it sounds like he never m materialized. It did. It did. It did. And the third one was for Peshev, the uh, the uh, congressman uh, who organized 43 deputies, uh, national deputies, to protest the expulsion, right. the proposed expulsion of the Jewish. Of the Jewish. Right. So there were three monuments, and we had a ceremony, incredible ceremony in 1946. No, 19, 1996. Excuse me. 1946. It's dedicate the forest in the presence of Bulgarians from Israel right. and in the presence of some officials. Uh, big officials, etc., etc. Et and this was called Yar Bulgaria, which was the Bulgarian national uh, forest in Israel, to recognize the role of the uh, 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 Bulgarian people Gentiles. and Gentiles, etc., etc., for our, in our saving. So what happened? Did it materialize on that date? We dedicated it, and no sooner the dedication took place, that voices from the uh, from the and Macedonian the Thracian and Thracian community in Israel, with very uh, important uh, uh, survivors right. from other countries, united to protest the establishment of a Bulgarian forest in in honor or in memory king, of yeah. king and all that and all that because 11,400 Jews were sacrificed from these two provinces that were part of Bulgaria exactly. but Bulgaria did not have the power to give them citizenship and do other things because yeah. Hitler was on top of everybody yeah. so basically it went to the Supreme Court and Judge Moshe Beisky B-E-I-S-K-E-Y who, by the way, I think is related to a survivor of the Schindler list uh, uh, people. Uh, he was a he was the judge, the Supreme Court judge, uh, charged with a with a uh, mission. And what did he decide? He did, after a year of of uh, of of, uh, of testimonies, etc., etc., that Bulgaria does not reserve Bulgaria does not deserve the honor of being put on the map as a country that saved its Jews. It's, it's very, very, sad. very sad. For me it was very sad. It was catastrophic. So this becomes the basis of all the political uh, people that are around the Holocaust memorials in yeah. Israel, yeah. Uh, Washington. This in, is the basis. This in, is the precedent. Exactly. In the politics of the Holocaust this became a very negative note on Bulgaria and despite of our 50,000 uh, Jews being saved, Bulgaria was not uh, acknowledged as a country uh, of, uh, of righteous Gentiles. Individuals were, right. but not, not the country. Not the country. Well, hopefully with, th with this kind of testimony from uh, a living survivor of that time, Rabbi Haim Asa from Burgas, Bulgaria. Perhaps uh, things in the future could be rectified and the proper recognition can be given to those people and organizations that at the time did did courageous, extraordinary acts of uh, belief, yes. uh, you know, for their brothers. I am 82 years old and I do hope that before my end comes that I will see Bulgaria being recognized as a country that saved 50,000 Jews. And I thank you very much for listening. Thank you. Shabbat Shalom. And with this, we say Shabbat Shalom, and uh, hope you watch the next uh, story from Rabbi Chaim Asa in Fullerton, California. This is David Viviano. It's Friday night, May 17, 2013. Thank you, Rabbi Asa. My pleasure, David. Thank you. Schai mai vrea, schai mai vrea de guță ană, ca să te îmbrac mai cu o năframă. Să-ți cumpăr, să-ți cumpăr cercei mai ană, dar eu n-am de unde mai cu o dară. Auzi, dragă fata, nechi dragă, aseară cu o niuă ta miceană. 
Shark cu nuș parale, biset cu un pas sandale, buzunare le simbole da. Mai apoi trecuta, vin ca o bancuta, și pe uii colituz.